Hello, bonjour, good day. How are you? Great trees, you said I should not call you babies or little angels. How are you boys and girls? They are fine. I am fine too. I hope you're enjoying this lesson. It's your teacher annunciator. Welcome to Easy Elimo. Learning Simplified. Wow. What ordinals. Yeah. You are still there. Now, we did the ordinals for the number one and we said the number is one and the ordinal name is first. The number is second and the ordinal name is second. The number is three. The ordinal name is third. Four, fourth. Five, fifth. Six, sixth. Seven, seventh. Eighth, eighth. Nine, ninth. Ten, tenth. What if I'm told to write the symbol? What if I'm told now? Can you indicate for us the symbol for this ordinal? Who can remind for me we did the ordinal, the ordinal symbols for numbers 1 to 5? Who can remind me what we did when we're doing the ordinal symbols for numbers 1 to 5? Who can remind me? Teacher, we used to take the number. Very good. Number here is 1. And the last two letters, which is ST, to give us first. What about the second one? You take the number 2. Then the last two letters, which is ND, to form the word second. What about the third one? Three. Then the last two letters to form third. Then four with the last two letters to form fourth. Then five with the last two letters to form fifth. Now we are on sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, and tenth. What are we supposed to do? The same way we did this one is the same way we are going to do those ones. So what happens here? I will take my number here is 6. So 6. Then I take the last 2 which is 6th. So for example, here we have said we just take the first, the second, the third, the fourth, and the fifth. Nice. Now, what about six? Six, I will take the number and the last two letters in the word to form the word six. When I come to seven, I also take the number with the last two letters to form the number seventh. Then I will take the number on eight with the last two letters to form eighth. And which is there? I will take the number nine with the last two letters to form ninth. And then the number with the last two letters to form the tenth. Are we together? Now, up to there. Is there any problem? There is no problem. So, when you go home during your own free time, I want us to fill this table. I want us to fill this table. This table has the number. This table has the number. It has the word. And it has the the number here, here you say number, and here is the ordinal name, and here is the symbol. So the number here I have four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then now I will fill on the name. My name here is first. And here the symbol is first. So you're gonna do this at home with the help of your guardian. And when you come back tomorrow, I wanna see this work well done in our books. Are we together? Are we together, class? As simple as that. So up to there, who can 
who cannot write ordinals 1 to 10 using the name and the symbol? Who cannot? Teacher, I can. Very good. You can now write the ordinals from 1 to 10 using the name and the symbol. Okay? Grade 3 is a one to wish you a nice day and I hope to see you in the next lesson as we continue to tackle number 11 up to number 20.